happens where it, it, it doesn't make the connecting or for some reason it did get put on the plane. It's not really lost, it's detained in whatever city it is. We, we know where it is fairly quickly. I mean, we've had a couple of different experiences. I remember my coming back from Europe one time, it got stuck in Amsterdam and it took us about uh, 15 hours to get it back. And it, it, it did or you did? I, I, I got home. I, usually always, I always get uh, to where I'm going. Oh darn, another 15 hours in Amsterdam. <laughs> yeah. That's what we all hate. <laughs> I haven't been to Amsterdam since university. So. <laughs> Look, that's what they think and that's what we're going to stick with, all right? Our last cup got to stay another day. Oh, uh, nuts. <laughs> Only wish, yeah. But, no, but it's especially ta I mean, you know, <laughs> it is. Exactly. I mean, the class it, it, is one it, thing, but it is especially I mean, it tech. Gets, it gets a priority tag on it. Every airline and every airport's different in how they handle it. There's a there's a note on our file, and we check in that we are traveling to Stanley Cup, and uh, depending on how the the, the, the flight agent uh, wants to handle it. And I mean, I can't tell them how to do their job. Things have changed since 9/11. Uh, with, there's a lot more security involved as far as just like in, in the United States as far as checking bags like the TSA has to inspect it now in front of me because I have it I have it locked right afterwards for I never